And we got Mr. Raccoon. And it's uh, 6 30 in the morning on a Thursday morning. On the 4th of uh, March. And I just get up to get a drink of water, go to the washroom, and there he was, and he came right over to the door. So he's eating peanut butter sandwich right now. He ate all the dry food that was out. So he had a peanut butter sandwich. Two of them actually. There's another one over here, and I got the I got fresh water out for him. You get into the sandwich there. Now where's he going? Oh, he's going to go get some sunflower seeds. There he goes. <laughs> That's how they do it. And Connor's over on the uh, counter. And Charlotte waiting for their breakfast. This is new for them, me to be up this early. Yeah. I had one fellow here last night. I don't know why he's picking on that one there, because the other one's lower. And he's still got... He's still got a sandwich there. And he's got his water. And it's getting daylight. And uh, there's some deer feed left, but the apples are gone. I bought fresh apples today, or last night yet. I got another big bag, 50 pound bag. Yeah, his hands are cold. It's about minus five out there. See how thin he is? Compared to the ones I had. See, he's not one of mine. If one of mine were there, they'd be still big and fat. But anyway, he wouldn't find any nourishment for, like... He would probably end up starving because there's no food in the woods for him right now. So, okay, he heard something. Here he goes, scampering off to the woods. Oh, he's still going. So I can turn that light off. Yeah, he didn't he didn't finish the sandwich. Didn't finish the other one, but he wanted those seeds. Oh, I see what it was. Girl walking down the road. 
the girl walking down the road spooked him. So, he may come back. Connor's car and my car. <laughs> Connor has his own vehicle. So I know what you're waiting for. Breakfast. You want breakfast, Connor? You hungry? Are you hungry? Come on. Connor's hungry. Yes, and I gotta get some more peanut butter. I got this little jar of crunchy. That was for the raccoon, and I got smooth for myself. So, I'll put them back up here. You hungry? Connor? Are you hungry? Huh? Looking at Daddy at 6.30 in the morning. I'm going back to bed and getting another sleep. I only had about three hours. Yeah, I gotta get more sleep, bud. Are you hungry? Charlotte, are you hungry? Okay, we're gonna, where's the food at? It's right here. I'll get them, I'll get them their food. Okay, people, we'll uh, put this up and And uh, Kimber Acosta is my manager for my YouTube, and she she does all the anything to do with the videos. She fixes them up for me and everything. And she uh, there's some things we had to get done to them, so she spent ten hours on them so far. So, and Kimber looks after uh, uh, Bob. And George, up in Wisconsin, so. Yes. Yes. You ready? Okay, Connor. Charlotte, you ready for breakfast? Okay. I'll just uh, leave this on here for a second. All right. Don't knock the camera over. Come here. Let me get your dish here. Here you go. I'm still in my bathroom. Ready? Here. Ready, Cheryl? Here. Wait a minute. You gotta wait a minute, girl. There. Yeah. Well, that was odd seeing that raccoon at this hour because usually they're all done hunting by 3 o'clock in the morning but he must have been super hungry. He would have been all right for that except that girl was jogging down the road. So anyway, he's having breakfast. Yes, I know. And she's having breakfast. And they got dry food there and water too. Yeah. So today, my doctor's calling me that, that instead of the doctor visit, you, you get a phone call sometime between noon and five. So I'm going to call forward my house phone to the truck in case I'm out, so in case he calls. Because today is Thursday and that's the day I go to Ron and Barb's every Thursday. That's my one night out. 
Okay, we're going to put this up now. And I had to open up a bag of dog food and, uh, and fill this up. <laughs> okay, we'll uh, talk to you later. Bye-bye.